Hi guys, it's AJ, and you can see me right there. And I want to introduce you to a good friend of mine right there. His name is Sedwick77. Of course, that's his YouTube name. And he wanted me to tell him what my favorite knife is. And he didn't want to see fantasy knives and wall hangers. He wanted to see an actual knife. And I've shown a lot of knives on my channel that I'm very proud of and I really enjoy having. But I think one of my all-time favorite, favorite knives is the one that I keep in my jewelry box. And it was made for me to wear as jewelry. But um, I'm afraid something will happen to it. And it's just too precious. So... This is my all-time favorite knife. For a little bit of uh, specs here on my favorite knife. It is under, can you see that, two inches long. See the little two right there, and maybe for a better understanding, I'll hold it up with a quarter. It's just a little bit over a quarter, and even though it was meant to be jewelry, we all know that a knife that won't cut isn't worth much. So even though it's hard to hold it right right now, you can see that I can cut with my little micro knife. My husband of the Hillbilly made this years ago and it's been my favorite ever since and I show this little guy to everybody. And it's one thing to be able to have the knowledge to make a knife. But when you can take that knowledge and make something so tiny and so intricate, I think it is just awesome. It has ivory handles and is completely, of course, handmade. So, Cedric, I hope that I answered your question okay. And I do want to apologize. I know I promised to get this out to you much sooner. But um, I've been a little busy lately, and hopefully this will be okay, and you will accept my apology. I know you will, because you're just super sweet. But he also wanted two shout-outs under 100 subs. And my two shout-outs are Pripito1. He is a new prepper to our community. Um, he and his family... Uh, are just getting up videos and showing people how to do things he, they can. His wife makes candles. Um, the kids are just cute as buttons. And my next shout out will go to Prep Bible. Um, he has a lot of different things on his channel and I wanted to shout his name out just because I think his name is very symbolic to a lot of the questions that have been going on lately. And my argument, so to speak, is that there really is not a whole lot of difference between a prepper and a survivalist. Um, prepping is just a form of survival. So I think his play on words, putting those two together so beautifully, um, really says a lot. So I love the name, buddy. And also, Cedric, thank you for asking me to do this for you. And I do again apologize for not getting it up sooner. And I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Don't forget to prep. Don't forget to keep looking forward. And try to find something to smile at a little bit today. Maybe if it's just laughing at me. I will talk to you guys later. And I will be doing um, a channel update this week and I'll let you guys know a little bit more about what's going on and what you can expect. I'll talk to you guys later and thanks for watching. Bye.